Okay, you guys, so I am back again with another unboxing. And don't you just love my new Converse shoes in the background? No, I'm just kidding. Um, so, uh, I'll have to give you guys a story about what happened to my Converse. But, anyways, this is a new unboxing. And I was turned onto these paints by Emily Artful. Uh, she is one of my favorite content creators um, on YouTube. And basically, she turned me on to these paints called Regina's Watercolors. And this is what the box looks like. Obviously, I have not opened it yet. I just, um, my husband doesn't let me have sharp objects. So, all I have is this. And don't worry, guys. It's not for anything uh, of an issue. I actually cut my finger off. I don't know if you can see it on camera. A little bit. I cut my finger off some odd years ago. And ever since then, um, I'll never live it down. Cut your finger off one freaking time. And they don't let you have sharp objects. Anyways, my rant is over. I digress. So this is the box, and I was turned on to Regina water, Regina's Watercolors by Emily Artful, and I had I wanted it so bad for my anniversary, and my husband was ever so kind to oblige me. Um, and so, ooh, this is nice. What's this say? My love, I hope you paint the world. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. I'm keeping it for my, my journal. And then it says have fun. Fun, and let's just hope this doesn't have my address on it. Let me go ahead and check. Okay, so this says about the paints and the pigments. So, um, definitely uh, pause the video. And if you want to read that, learn how to read sideways. Because I'm really awful at this. Um, so there's that. And then here's one of her cards. It says Regina's Watercolors. And you can flip it over, and here is her website. Please go there. Um, these are really awesome. Now, I'm not going to lie, they're not cheap. But you know what? If you want good grade watercolors, not even good. I, From what I understand, these are really awesome grade watercolors made of majority-wise pigment. Um, then definitely go to Regina's Watercolor. All right. Like I said, uh, it, it took me a bit to get here, but I'm so glad. Oh my gosh, you don't even know how excited I am right now. I'm beyond excited. Ooh, what's this? Oh, okay. Um, and it also came with like a little miniature sketch book. Like it's a, a block of watercolor paper, which is so sweet of them to include. And it comes with a little tool to get it off. It looks like a pick you know, like a guitar pick, and use that to get this watercolor off the block. And since it's on a block, I'm going to assume that this is really good watercolor, because uh, really good watercolor comes on a block. I know that sounds weird to say that. Oh, what else is in here? And it looks like it came with a, um, a paintbrush. Excuse my, like, brain moment there. It doesn't seem to come with a number, but it looks like a number six paintbrush. Um, not entirely sure, but we'll find out as we paint along. I haven't quite gotten there yet. So there's nothing left in the box. And it comes in bubble wrap. Guys, you know how much I just want to... I'll just save it for my kids later, because I know that that will be hours of endless fun. Oh, gosh. Now I need two hands. You ever wonder, like, why you guys don't have extra hands the more kids you have, you know? I've always wondered that. Like, shouldn't you be able to pop arms out like, you know, the Ben 10 style uh, monster? You know, the one that comes out all green and stuff and he's got, like, really awesome abilities. So, oh yes, there we go. Save that for later. Anyways, um, so this is the Regina watercolor, um, and look at that. Oh my gosh, I love it. Look, it comes with your own little, let's make your own swatch kit. See, and I had already planned on making my swatches. You see what I mean? Um, that is so cool. Um, and this is number 93 out of 100. This is a certificate of authenticity. I will keep that. This is so fun freaking cool you guys okay i've never in my life had a watercolor palette that offered you your own swatch kit that is so cool i'm i'm not being paid by any of these places okay clearly i do not make enough money on this website to do so all right so let's see what we got here cool off trucks can get 
well over 100 degrees during shipping and cause these paints to melt. Stick them in the fridge for one to two hours before unpacking them for best results. Okay, so it does look like these are a wee bit cracked, but I'm not uh, surprised only because um, I'm, I'm not surprised because like she said, you know, cake, I know that these are pans that are poured out in there. Ooh, they are sticky too. So I know that these are poured out pans directly in here. So this is not surprising. Um, and as most people know, with watercolors, you have to spray them down if you want the best results. So no one cares that there's little holes. No one cares that there's little cracked pans and stuff. I'm, I'm so glad that they gave us this little thing here because a lot of people get this uh get a pan like this and don't have one of these and they're like oh my god i got crappy watercolors no dude you do not get crappy watercolors you just clearly don't know how to maintain them anyways so this is the watercolors and this listen to that that's glass baby that is glass okay that is glass that is not anything else that is 150 million percent a glass palette so that is so cool. I love that. This is plastic, but this is what the uh, back of it looks like. And obviously I've got to get it taken off, but I will let these cool down and then I will go ahead and make a video of me swatching them. All right, guys, thank you so much for this video and viewing. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And um, like I said, go ahead and comment below and let me know if you have gotten these or uh, if you watched Emily Artful's video on uh, when she got these herself. So, alrighty, I'll chat with you later.